Hey, Shalom, all praises, honor, glory goes to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rachakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elder bishops of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to you, fellow brothers out there, pushing his word and truth and his sincerity. Shabbat Chanat, uh, doing a, a walk and talk lesson. This is just a, a walk and talk lesson, quick lesson, uh, impromptu. Kind of we'll just kind of uh, meditate on some things. And, uh, you know, spirit led me to, you know, you know, make a video on it. Lord's will is edifying. And basically, I want to speak about how the rulers of this world, which we know them as the Edomites. OK, in particular, Amalek. OK, of the tribe of, of Edom. OK, which Edom means red. The red people of the earth that are in rulership. They come in the spirit of Satan, okay? Especially the uh, the elites, though the movers and the shakers, the people that are that are in the shadows. You don't you don't know about them, okay? Now you know the brothers in the know, people in the know, and you know a lot of people have heard you know all the elites, the the so called Illuminati, this and that, which is it's it's a conspiracy, you know it's put off as a conspiracy so to speak. But yeah, it is a conspiracy. Uh, a conspiracy is is when one or, or two two or more parties conspire evil against another party, and and, and that's and that's uh, that's exactly what uh, has been going on since these people have came into power. Okay, uh, especially during the Renaissance. But they they come in the spirit of Satan, and they they do the bidding of Satan. Let me bring out a scripture. OK, and it's clear it's clear as as day to see that, you know, these people are of Satan. Uh, but this world is, is such in gross darkness in which good is evil and evil is good. But but a hey, through, through the mercies of Yah Basham Shai. OK, he has shined his light upon his elect to be able to see through the darkness and, and be able to identify, OK, the issue in the world. And that, that issue is Esau Edom, okay, the wicked, which he's soon about to be destroyed. This is Second Thessalonians two, and and then three. Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come. That day is speaking about the day of the Lord, okay. Yahweh Shai coming back and redeeming his elect from off the earth, the four corners of the earth, and then destroying the wicked. OK, that day is not going to come except what? Except there come a falling away first. And that happened. That was us going into captivity because contrary to popular belief the the so-called Negro, Hispanic, Native American, they have booming, bustling cities, man. They have metropolises. They were in rulership at one point in time. OK, in uh, West Coast of Africa and Jerusalem. OK, the land of Israel. OK, different uh, uh, the North, Central, South America. They had they had, you know, high level cities where the most high destroyed it. That was the falling away. OK, and through the devil, he, he's he's pretty much made it to where our people don't know that they, you know, that they they were rulers, that they ruled at a particular time. OK. Uh, for, uh, it says, except there come a falling away first. And that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. See, it's the man of sin. Who is the man of sin? Esau Edom. And he, he has been revealed. And he's being revealed, you know, um, day in and day out. You have this video circulate. I'm not going to go too much into it about your, your, uh, your pre El Presidente, Sleepy, you know, doing some real, real dirty stuff, man. Some real dirty stuff. That's, all, that's pretty much all I'm going to say on it. If you know, you know. If you don't know, you don't know. OK. Verse four, who opposeth. The, the point is, everything is going to come out on this devil, man. Everything is going to come out on this devil. And I want to bring that scripture. OK, there's nothing hid that's not going to be brought into light. OK, all this man's wickedness is being brought out on the forefront. OK, and the prophets are the main one that are speaking these things. OK, and then it's also his own tongue is falling upon him. You have his own his his own people, his own people coming against him. 
who opposeth and exalteth himself above all that is called the Most High. They're doing away with Christianity. They're doing away with the Catholic Church. What are they telling you? They're trusting in science. They're saying their science is uh, uh, the savior. OK, they're saying their technology is the savior. They're not saying, oh, you need to pray to the most high. You, uh, your faith. They're not they're not talking about the faith. But those people that are in control of those organizations on the highest level, they they come in the spirit of Satan. They do the bidding of Satan. And if you were to know if these people, if these average people knew what the elite uh, were doing, OK, how they are in charge of child trafficking rings, how they do child sacrifices, how they they eat human flesh, they drink. They drink uh, 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 blood, human blood. They torture people. OK, they mass murder people. They 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 pervert and, and uh, everything. OK, uh, water, the, the, the they pervert oxygen. You know, they I mean, all types. If people only knew what these people did, this world would go crazy. OK. Who opposed and exalted himself above all. That is called the Most High, or that is worship, so that he, as the Most High, sit in the temple of the Most High, showing himself that he is God. So he's in a power position. He has God-like power on the earth, and he's exercising that God-like power. But he, what he's saying is, you know, the, the God in the clouds, you know, the God, you know, that's above us, that con that controls everything. He's not real. I'm I'm actually God. Look at my algorithm. Look what I can do. Look, I, I got to look. I, I, I can make a cell phone. You could talk to somebody on the other side of the, uh, of the earth. And he's doing a lot more demonic thing. He's trying to open portals. He's trying to, you know, see the future. With some of those powers, the most I gave him. OK, some some of those powers, the most I gave him. But each time he tried to tap into that, the same outcall, the same outcome is revealed. Him being destroyed. <laughs> So he, he understands he has a short time and he's trying to do the best that he can to destroy as many people on the earth and to negate the prophecies of the elect waking up and him being uh, uh, destroyed and revealed, which is impossible. The ball has already uh, the ball has already moved. OK, even even if you crash the Internet, OK, even if you try to scrub the Internet, you you pretty much you cut off, uh, uh, cut the Internet off. You, you 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 proclaim it that it was a cyber attack from whatever country and then when it comes the internet comes back on you control it you scrub all the sites okay uh, uh pretty because you i mean everything's on the internet okay you, you you pretty much take it all down okay even if you do that that's still that's still not going to or that's still uh uh, uh um it's not going to stop you from being destroyed or you being revealed. You, the cat is already out of the bag, Esau. Okay. Uh, remember ye not that when I was with, with you, I told you these things. And now ye know what withholdeth that he might be, that he might be revealed in his time. And this is the time. This is absolutely the time in which Esau, Edom, the wicked are being revealed they're being they're being revealed for the demons that they are okay in, in particular i'm speaking about the elites okay the average everyday human on the earth they don't know what the hell is going on okay we're, we're not speaking to the average everyday human we're speaking to those in the know okay to build up to build up their faith okay so he's being he's being revealed and it's time it's 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 time for this man to be revealed and he is and now you know, uh, I'm sorry, verse 7. Give me a second. Give me a second. For the mystery of iniquity does already work, right? Because he was speaking about the Romans. The Romans are the same people that are in power now. OK, that's why they call it the Renaissance. What was the Renaissance all about? Rebirthing the Roman way, which is other than is nothing other than the Edomite way. OK, pedophilia. OK, their science, their religion, their architecture, their, uh, their education, their uh, politics, 
the way that they rule, it's all, it's all, it's all back. Okay, the, the draconian hand, the, uh, the, the, uh, the, 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 the lying measures, the, the lying tongue, I should say, the lying tongue. Okay, the conquering of the dark nations. Okay, he, he's running it back. Okay, well, we're at the end. We're at the end of this man. Okay, so the so Paul was speak saying that it pretty much that that man of sin is the Romans. It's already working. Only he who now, only he who now letteth will let. That's the Most High until he be taken out of the way, because the Most High he has this, he has this uh uh, uh you know his his algorithm playing. He so likes to you know boast himself in his algorithm. Well, this is the Most High's algorithm. Okay, and there's nothing that you Edomites can do. Okay, to get yourself out of this of this uh of this problem you're in, you're in you're, this quagmire you're in. Okay, let me just cross the street. Give me a second. A second. Okay. Verse eight, and then shall that wicked be revealed. Right. And then shall, so all these things have to perspire. Okay, the Roman, the Romans, they had to go down. Okay, we had to flee. Okay, we had to get taken down. We had to go into slavery. Okay, then Ezekiel 37 chapter had to come into play. Okay, the, the valley of the dry bones, the spirit had to come back upon us. Now the spirit is coming back upon us. Now it's time for this man to be completely revealed for the devil that he is, to, to be revealed for the man of sin. Because he's boasted himself and being a man of God. Okay, when you type in the word God, okay, or image of God, what are you going to find? You're going to find a white man. You type in the, the image of Christ, right? Or Jesus Christ, what's written in the scriptures, right? The, the name written in the script. What do you, when you, when you type that in, or when you think about that, you think about a white man, right? That's all loving. That, that that just gives you hugs that's all uh he just he just accepts everything you know he's he's a good he's a good person but on the contrary the edomites they're not good they they use the bible to enslave people they use the bible to murder people they use the bible to justify their wickedness now now it's coming out now now they're they're upset they're upset because they're being reproached okay for all their sins well, you should have just been a demon. You should have been like, look, this is who I'm. This is who I'm about. I'm about Satan. I worship. I worship the devil. Nobody. Could, OK, these people, they worship Satan. OK, we expect it from them. But see, you lied and say that you're of God and not. And see, that's the issue, Esau. You lied and you took upon the Bible and you pretty much said, OK, I'm I'm the people of the Bible. Well, now you have to now you have to get that work now. Now you have to be judged. OK. Uh, uh, you have to be judged because you added and you took away from the book. OK, and this is essentially what's happening. You're you're being judged. OK, your society is, is completely going down. OK, and you're being revealed by the by the spirit of the Lord's mouth. OK. Let me let me continue. Give me a moment. <clears throat> uh, verse eight again, it says. <clears throat> And then shall that wicked be revealed whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. OK, and that that's uh, directly tied to his men that the Lord has set up to go out in the highways and the hedges and to curse your ass out. OK, and to reveal all the wickedness that you've done as well as your own tongue. Like I was saying, your own tongue falling upon you, your own people bringing out uh, things against you. OK, of all the all the, the, just the disgusting activities that go on in the earth, you're being revealed by your own people. But, uh, and, but that's the spirit of the Lord's mouth. Because Yahweh Bashamah Shah, he controls everything. It says whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth and shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. And that's and that's pretty much the end of this man. And he knows that he understands that that's the uh, that's the uh, the end game, the uh, the, the end game of him is Yahweh Shai coming back and destroying him. That's why he's preparing. Okay. He's preparing for that war in heaven, man. 
He's prepared. He has technology. The Mossad gave him technology. Okay. He gave him this technology. He has a space force. These, why, why do these European nations have space forces? And why, why do they, when they, you know, they, they hide the fact that, you know, of UFOs, so to speak. They, they hide the fact of these UAPs, these, these, uh, these, uh, uh, vehicles that are in the sky. And they give you a distorted understanding of what they are. They say that they're aliens. They say that they're this. They say that they're that. But we know what they are. Okay. He doesn't want, he doesn't want the world to know that those vehicles are going to be that his downfall he doesn't want you to know that as well as they're going to be okay the salvation of the nation of israel yet we're telling the whole world now so that now the world knows so when this event happens and esau edom he knows that this event is going to come okay this is uh when yahweh shai comes to destroy this man with the brightness of his coming okay he knows that this event is going to come verse 9 even him who's Whose coming is after the working of Satan with all power and signs and lying. What? And this is this is how this man gets down. OK, he gets down by witchcraft. This whole society is filled with nothing but witchcraft. OK, it's filled with nothing but, uh, 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 you know, um, uh, enchantments. OK, things that things to, to make your mind all messed up. Things things to bug you the, the hell out. OK. He gives you the illusion uh, of freedom, but that, that freedom is really the freedom to go against and to break the laws of the Heavenly Father. That's the freedom that he has given the whole earth, okay? Because there, there's, a, a certain, there's a certain way that you're supposed to treat the earth. There's a certain way that you're supposed to treat your brother. There's certain food that you're supposed to consume and certain food that you're not supposed to consume. There's certain do's and don'ts. Okay, uh, 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 on this on this world, in this world, okay. And if you don't follow by those, you know, guidelines, then judgment comes. The Most High he'll, he'll destroy, he'll just destroy your your whole society. And this has happened countless times. This is why all these societies, even even the nation of Israel, went down. We had power at, at a particular time, but we weren't going according to the 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 the, uh, the Heavenly Father. And what did he do? He destroyed it. But see, now, you know, uh, through through much work, the Most High, he's, he's, you know, he set this thing up to where we're going to receive everlasting life. And Yahweh Shai, he came and he pretty much made it to where it's going to be an everlasting kingdom. OK, under righteousness. OK. Uh, and with all deceivableness and unrighteousness in them that perish because they receive not the love of the truth. That they that they might be saved. But let me just get one more scripture. I'm gonna close it out. Um right. Luke twelve and two. For there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed, neither hid that shall not be hidden. And the wicked elite they pride themselves in their their um secrecy okay so-called secret societies they pride themselves in that okay but what's being what's happening is you're being revealed on a god level that the heaven shall reveal his iniquity and the earth shall rise up against them that's uh joel the 20th chapter uh, uh, it's either the 27th or the 20th 27th or 28th verse okay so you're you're being revealed by, by the heavens by the angels you're not you're not being revealed by just just you know uh, uh, just men, okay. For there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed, neither hid that shall not be known. Right, like who the man of sin is. Therefore, whatsoever ye have spoken in darkness shall be heard in the light, and that which ye have spoken in the ear in the closet shall be proclaimed upon the housetop. So essentially, the Most High saying, "Hey, look, anything in the dark is gonna come. It's gonna come to light." OK, if you're if you're wicked, it's going to be revealed. And that's essentially what's happening, man. The wicked is being revealed. OK, and it's and it's, it's plain to see that they come in a spirit of Satan. OK, so, hey, that was a, a lesson. You know, I pray that the lesson was edifying until next time. Shalom to the lecture.